Good morning, Potty Mouth Jesus loving followers. It was a Potty Mouth morning today. So uh, trying to do the trying to do the juice, and um, some days are better than others. And you know, there's days like I'm doing great, and they taste good. You know, I've got enough sweet to complement the not so sweet. Well, I keep reading more and more, and um, one of the big things they say is a huge cancer fighter is garlic. <laughs> We've talked about this before. So today I was all brave and thought, okay, I got this. I'm going to put all my normal stuff in there. I'm going to start adding little things little by little, like celery. Um, way back in the day when I used to juice, Tristan and I would just like experiment with all kinds of things. We threw away a lot of juice, um, especially one where we added a bunch of celery one day. Holy moly, that stuff is so potent. So no, um, we don't do a lot of celery these days, but I'm slowly getting there. So like yesterday's juices, I had one stalk of celery in there and it was totally fine. Like couldn't even taste it, it was good. So today I thought, oh, I'm gonna add a little bit more celery and I'm gonna be so brave and add a clove of garlic. Oh my gosh, holy hell. Um, I ain't even worried about stinking like garlic at this point. I'm worried about choking the rest of this down. Uh, it's tough. So, uh, I, I don't even know how to describe, it doesn't even, it's not even like, you know, like, because I love garlic, like in my food, like sauteed garlic and onions and stuff like that. This is not sauteed, um, and there's no onion or, or steak or mushroom in here or anything, you know, so I'm just kind of trying to pretend it's a big fat carrot cake instead of carrot juice with all this stuff, but, uh. We're getting there. <laughs> We're getting there slowly, but surely. So, um, yeah, this, this is a little potent for me today, but I'm going to choke it down anyway. So I made about 16 ounces because I added all this stuff thinking, oh, I'll get a big old super pack juice today. Mm -hmm. Super pack kicking my ass. So, uh, mm -hmm. yeah. So we got about 16 ounces and this glass doesn't hold quite 16 ounces. So I like downed the rest of it that was in my little measuring book cup. I like totally choked that down super fast so I could come up here and do this video. I got to go pick up Tristan from school and um, it like burned my throat. It's so potent and I don't even know what's burning my throat. If it's the celery or what. So when I first got done with the juice and tasted it, I was like, holy hell, I, uh, holy crap. So I started adding things like I added another half of an apple to the juice. I added a, another quarter of a lemon because that lemon really cuts down on the like rankness of your juice. I don't know that all the acid in the lemon. Um, and then I put a whole other carrot stick in there um, and it helped. It helped. I, I'm going to I'm going to choke this down. I'm going to do it. Um, but now I have to put it in a travel mug so I can go get Tristan. So there's just another dirty mug and my dirty juicer and whatever. So it's constantly cleaning vegetables juicing, cleaning the juicer, cleaning the mugs, because I got to go through 14 of them just to have a drink, apparently. So at night, it's funny because I'll do dinner and the guys will be eating their dinner and I'll go sit on the couch with my measuring cup, you know, the glass measuring glasses, full of juice and a straw because I don't want to dirty 14 cups. Um, today I did, however, so whatever. Yeah. Uh-huh. That's today. So yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah, go juice. Raw. Uh, yeah, so that's, uh, that's today. So like I said, every day is a learning day. Every day we're doing something new, trying to, trying to get more stuff in here. I have cabbage in here, a beet, um, and not whole anything, like just chunked up sections of, like I have a quarter of a beet with some beetroot and, uh, some cabbage and all this organic stuff. And I've got arugula. Oh, maybe that's part of the other weird taste. I don't usually do arugula, but it was on another list I read about. So here we go with arugula and spinach. Um, I also found a uh, nature path. I think that's how you say it in Grand Rapids. And um, so I filled out all the stuff online. I had a good phone consultation with them today, this morning, and hopefully I'll get a call to set up an appointment soon. Um, cause clearly I need some guidance. Like, like I can buy all the books, I can read all the books, but it's still overwhelming. So I'm hoping to find somebody with some more knowledge than myself. Cause, um, self-taught juicing's hurt my throat. Anyway, 
uh, that's it. So we're just moving forward and hopefully I'll get a call back from this, this doctor's office and be able to go see them and see what they've got to offer. God, I can smell this. <laughs> it's in my face. Jesus Christ. Um, yeah, mm -hmm. I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength, right? What is that? Philippians 4, 13. Let's say it people. I can do all things through Christ who give me strength. Give me strength to drink this Jesus. That's what we're asking for today. Uh, and probably tomorrow and the next day and the day after that. So anyway, today, today's the juicing day that I had to talk about. So anyway, we're just moving forward and trying to keep chugging along. Had my blood work last week. My counts are still a little bit low. Um, so again, once they're up to normal, I wait two weeks and then she wants to start me on that pill. I'm still on the fence. Um, I feel some days I'm like, okay, I'll do the pill and juice. Um, and then other days I'm like, I'm just going to go green, but then something will happen. We'll be out and about and I'll, I don't know, have Chinese food for dinner or whatever. And it's just like, crap, how do I do this all day long with a, with a busy schedule? So I'm still getting used to, you know, just the routine of it all and trying to maintain life with health. Um, yeah, that's, that's the key to success here, I think. So that's what we're working on. <gasps> Aside from juicing garlic. Never thought that would be a good idea. I don't know. Um, could have made the super, super, super food um, a little more tasty than garlic, I suppose. But here we go. So you all have a very good day. And enjoy your week. Happy Monday. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and I don't know, tell your friends. Because I forget what the other one is. Anyway, have a great day, people. Love y'all. Take care.